I love giraffe because uh, it's one of the tallest animals. I'm also a tall woman. <laughs> Every time I see a giraffe, I'm like, oh, I'm almost getting into giraffe. <laughs> Everybody used to ask, when are we going to see the giraffe here? Now integrating the issues of peace with conservation. For you to consider giving uh, space to wildlife, it means you as a person, you are at peace. This is now a turning point for us as a community. It's like a dream come true. I could not imagine that at some point we could have the giraffe moving in a native homeland where they used to be. It was a big, big project. But the idea was that the giraffe would mate and make the herd grow. Everyone was like, is this going to fail? I'm David O'Connor, and I'm president of Save Giraffes Now. So these giraffes are incredibly special, not only because they're wonderful animals in themselves, but they're Rothschild's giraffe, and uh, they're really critically endangered. They are the key to repopulating the entire Western Rift Valley, where giraffe became extinct. So with these eight giraffes, now they'll start breeding, and hopefully repopulate all the way to the border of Uganda. When the first giraffe became pregnant, everyone became awful. Asiwa is pregnant. I'm very happy, I'm very happy. <laughs> Both communities have come to see, wow, our giraffes now are here. The conservancy is a very good thing. The giraffes brought was peace, a big peace. And uh, the peace has also given an opportunity for the wildlife to thrive back. Right now, we don't want even a, we cannot even hear a single gunshot. The plan was working, it was really going perfectly. 